So for tricks, we're also going to work on leg weaves. So we worked on, if you recall last week, cap here, sit. We were getting dogs through, yes, through, through, yes. Good job, trying to get them to come through our legs, which is a weird ask of these dogs. So now what we're gonna try to do, we're gonna start um, with our dogs in front of us, sit. So he's kind of a little closer to my left leg, which is totally fine. That puts me in a really great position to make a choice. Yeah, that's what I thought. Beagles, man. <laughs> you don't like vocalizations, don't with the beagles. <laughs> All right. So he's on my left. I'm gonna step forward with my right foot and I'm gonna bend this knee. This bend is eventually going to indicate to the dog, I'm gonna come out and around this way. So for now, he's on my left. I'm gonna step forward with my right, through. And while he's here at my knee, I'm gonna treat. So my right knee and my right arm are out in front. This is going to feel so weird. Um, and I'll, I'll demonstrate the mechanics in a minute. So he's here on my right. I'm now going to step forward with my left and bend that knee through. Yes. Through. Yes. So the leg weave, I'm going to start here. If I want him on my right, sit. I'm going to step forward with my left. So my opposite from the, side, the dog side, that leg is going to come out. Good job, well done, catch. So the leg weave, where it can go wrong, and this is some common mistakes with the leg weave. I'll do it from, uh, I think maybe this side is better. You'll let me know if it's not Nick. Sit. So if you come forward at the same side that the dog is on, and I ask him to come through, when my next leg comes over, I'm going to trip. I don't wanna hurt my dog and I don't wanna fall on my face. So that's why it's really important that whatever side the dog is on, it's the opposite leg that comes through. And as they're weaving, that's when your leg comes forward. Um, one thing that I teach my disc dog students, we do a lot of this with frisbees or with discs. Hop up, down, stay. The, the hardest part is the walk. So if you've ever watched the Monty Python Ministry of Silly Walks, I definitely feel like John Cleese in this. Okay. All right, so right, uh, right leg is back, left leg has a bend. This is the indication for the dog to come and circle this way. So my left hand and left leg, right hand, right leg, left hand, left leg, right hand, right leg. Jane Fonda, eat your heart out. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, so definitely wear either leggings or comfortable pants with this, this actually is, uncomfortable sometimes in jeans, especially if you're squatting a lot. Um, that's why I wear this sexy number when I do disc dog classes. <laughs> um, cap this way. So weave, weave. And I eventually want weave to mean you keep going. Yes, until you get the yes and the stop. Alternatively, you could just say through on each repetition and that's fine. I usually would also uh, encourage all of you Yes, treat, yes, treat. So you've got handfuls of food. Yes, treat, at least for the first few days. And then you can start playing around with variable reinforcement schedules where you treat for maybe two and then one and then three and then one and then three and then two. So you can kind of play around with it. Um, if you have any questions, please send me a note um, and we will get you guys on the right foot. Um, but that's a leg weave.